your serve have a hitch or a glitch that's throwing off your rhythm, maybe making you make some double faults and it's just frustrating you? Well, today I'm gonna to give you the number one drill to get rid of those hitches and glitches that you can do pretty much anywhere. So you're gonna love this lesson. It's one of dozens of lessons inside the seven day serve challenge. This is a brand new serve challenge. Make sure you go to sevendayservechallenge.com to sign up for free. We're starting February 21st and you're gonna get free 48 hour access to each and every day. Plus you can even send me videos and I'll analyze it for free. So you don't wanna miss this one. It's really awesome. Go up in the card section or in the description section to sign up or you can simply go to sevendayservechallenge.com all right, let's start with exercise today. is a sock serve warm up. All you got to do is get a sock, stick some tennis balls in there. I got three tennis balls in here and just start working this rhythmic motion and you're trying not to let the balls in the sock stop. You want to keep it flowing. And the reason why this is so good because when I'm showing you how to do the serve motion today, Lots of people, when they get into the racket drop position, it's not smooth, it's not flowing. Now, as you get warmed up too, see, I'm looking at the camera, but really, as I'm looking at the camera, I go, you know what, Pete, I need a better tilt. So also, as you go, really think about throwing those socks up to the sky. Get here, throw those socks up to the sky. Let me show you a couple of the back view. So as you can see, as I'm doing this, I'm throwing the socks up to the sky, I'm working on my tilt, and I'm keeping that rhythmic flow. This is really gonna help us, and as I'm doing this, I'm imagining that I'm attacking the tennis ball with the edge of my racket because that's going to be crucial to learning how to get to that moment of truth in your serve motion. So as I'm doing that, I'm imagining that I'm attacking the ball with the edge of the racket because if you watch the pro serve, like I just showed you in that video, it almost looks impossible that they're not going to hit the ball, but then they end up hitting the ball. So now what we're going to do is we're going to get into exercises to where you get comfortable attacking the tennis ball with the edge of the racket. That's going to be the key to this success.